Hello friends, this is Sanjeev from slidervilla.com. Today I will talk about the next gen gallery add-on. It integrates the most powerful image gallery WordPress plugin named Next Gen Gallery with Slider Villa sliders. Next Gen Gallery WordPress plugin has more than 10 million downloads and that's why this add-on could be helpful for many WordPress users. To use the Next Gen Gallery add-on, first you need to install any of our sliders. Say for example, over here I have installed Debox slider from Slider Villa. And the very first thing is to install the Next Gen Gallery WordPress plugin. So once you install the Next Gen Gallery WordPress plugin, you get these many options to manage the gallery or create a gallery with a lot of images. So over here, it's very simple to create a gallery. For that, just click on Add Gallery and Images. You can name your gallery. Just name it and then start uploading files. Start upload. Alright, so this gallery has been created. You now go to the manage gallery. Here you can see this gallery is created with four images and the gallery ID is three for this newly created gallery. Now I want this gallery images to show in one of our sliders. For example, the box slider. For that, you know, it is very simple to use it. You just need to add a short code anywhere you want. Now here I have written SVNG Gallery, which is the short code for Next Gen Gallery add-on. Then mention the slider name as Dbox. Slider is equal to Dbox, and then Gallery ID is equal to three because the newly created gallery was having the ID as three. Publish it. Now over here you can see. All the images from the slider gallery, the next gen gallery that we created on next gen gallery, all the images are appearing in the box slider. I can fetch the information if there is any. I can hide it. It's very simple. For advanced users, there are more uh, shortcode parameters available for next gen gallery add on. For example, if you want to omit first three or four images, you can use offset parameter. So for example, I'm using offset is equal to two. So I'm actually omitting first two images from that gallery. So just two images are appearing over here and the first two images are omitted because of the offset parameter. If, you're, if you have installed one, more than one slider from Slider Villa, say for example you are having Dbox as well as Pointel on your site, you just need to replace the Dbox with the name of the slider, it's Pointel, update it. So here you can see the slider is appearing in pointer. So the next gen gallery images are appearing inside pointer. On the manage gallery page, say so using next gen gallery feature, for example, I want to omit this lighthouse image. So the feature is available here as exclude. If I exclude this image from next gen gallery, now I'm removing this offset parameter and again getting back. 
characters the box now the lighthouse image should not appear in our slider you can see the lighthouse image has been removed from the slider as well so however you manage the images in action gallery those changes will appear in our slider as well so that is how the next gen gallery add-on integrates slider villa sliders with the popular image gallery product that is next gen gallery thanks for watching